What's up, guys? I was just on a coaching call with a client, and it reminded me of just how powerful the words that we say to ourselves really are and what a game changer they can make in day-to-day life across the board and whatever it is that you want to change in your life. Here's just one example of uh, something that I manifested and realized on this last Greece trip. I'm going to put a bunch more here too, but one of them was I used to definitely be very afraid to fly after 9-11. I had a lot of anxiety around flying, uh, particularly around takeoff and landing. I, to the point where like I had to have a shot or two before I got on the flight or a Xanax or something to just like totally prevent a panic attack essentially before flights. Um, And then once I learned how important it is our words and our thoughts are, I began applying uh, my Centrella method. I have two steps that I specifically applied. One is called Think It and the other is called Say It. And they're mindset training uh, tools that help you manifest any outcome you want. And so I started saying to myself, I love to fly. I would get all dressed up to fly. So I'd be like, I'm fly when I fly. Um, and I would say I, you know, take off and landing are my favorite part. When I take off, I just uh, leave all the stress behind and can totally relax and relinquish control and take off is amazing. I love that moment of lift and all this stuff. Um, and landing feels so great cause I'm at the destination I wanted to be in and I always feel safe and secure when I fly. So I started really changing that dialogue using mottos and mantras, uh, proactively, Um, and then especially when I would fly and I've done this for years and for the past, I don't know, five years or so, um, I have not had fear or anxiety around flying. I have not needed my Xanax. I've felt great. It's been fine. Um, but this last trip when I took off, like the moment of lift, the moment of takeoff to Greece on this last trip, I literally had this moment of like, just joy and lift and I was just leaving everything here and just so excited for the adventure that was coming and let all stress go and just was in that moment and just genuinely felt physical joy at the moment of lift and it was so crazy because it dawned on me that that was the moment that those mottos were actually true that was my is my favorite part of flying, take off and landing. So here's the deal, whatever it is that you are avoiding, that you're afraid of, whatever story that you have told yourself that doesn't serve you and is not making you happy and is not producing results that feel good or that are causing stress and anxiety, you absolutely can change it. What is the opposite of that? How would you love to feel instead? And you start implanting that new story aggressively and doing it as often as you possibly can. You do it proactively when, you know, so I would do it days before I fly, I'd do it whenever I think about flying. And then I would do it in the moment when I was about to fly. I would, you know, pump myself up and just be like, God, this is my favorite part. I love this. It's great to the point where I just never had to think about it anymore and I am no longer a person who is afraid to fly. So if you wanna change your belief systems, it comes down to just it being that simple. What am I telling myself? What is the story that I'm repeating? And, And what do I want instead? Be aggressive, change the story and you're gonna change the results and you'll literally change who you are. It is the coolest thing. And if you want to know how to train your thinking to get what you want and create a vision for your future and a plan to execute it, um, then I would love to have you in Transformation Bootcamp. I have two spots left for my class that starts on June 10th. It's the first time I've uh, opened this class up to the public in almost three years. It's been exclusively uh, for corporate teams. So jump on this chance and I would love to teach you everything that I know on how to get the life you want. Let's go.